Hi, Kren. Hi. We're in Victoria. Woo! The microphone's far from both of us, so it should be equal. Hello. Uh, we planned this trip for months. Yes. Uh, to come visit where I grew up and where my parents live. Yes. And then it became a sad visit. It did. But now to try to level us out, now that all the craziness is behind us, we're going to open some Lego minifigures that me and my mom bought like four months ago. Woohoo! And forgot about. I need um, scissors. Here you are. Yay. So, how are you finding the West Coast? I think it's great. I since, love the weather. Since you've never been to the West Coast ever before. I've never been to the Canada part of the West Coast. Ignoring the part where we have videos that we shot in Portland like yeah. two years ago. <laughs> also, who's this going to be? I don't know. I see uh, fire. Uh, oh, this is the evil wizard man. Rodimus? Kind of. <laughs> I don't know anything about Star Wars. So I don't know much about this set. All I know is I got a fencer from it. It's this guy. We got this guy. Look oh. at that guy. Wow, okay. Look at that operator. Yeah, look at the little fire. Yeah. I'll put him together. Cool. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt you. You didn't. It's all good. So how's... Uh, how's Victoria? How's, how's Victoria? Victoria is really beautiful. We took a drive along the coasty part yesterday, and it was so gorgeous. You could see out in the ocean and then past it, well, not the ocean, like an inlet. Mm -hmm. There were mountains, rounded old mountains that belonged to the U.S. U.S. And there were banks of clouds coming in, and it was so pretty. It was really, really beautiful. And all the colors were just really lovely. So... We were talking on social media as a whole bunch before the trip became a sad trip. Yes. About doing V Build live streams and stuff. Yes. Uh, so we might still do one. Woohoo! Gonna kind of see how things go. Absolutely. Me and Crin are here for another week. Yay! Things are somewhat less sad overall. Yes. Although it still happens now and then. Yes. But uh, we would like to do a V Build live stream because uh, it probably seems weird to some of you, but like. Doing stuff like this is actually a great way to even my head out and just kind of make me feel better. Yeah, returning and, to normal activities. Yeah, and you know, <laughs> we're not prioritizing making internet videos over looking after family stuff. So we're not complete scumbags yet. <laughs> this guy's a complete scumbag, look at him. Does he have a hat? Nope, oh. he's bald because he's an evil wizard. Oh. I gotta get these out of the way because they're messing with autofocus. All right. Meh. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for the trash. At, I threw that at Krim. <laughs> bad. But yeah, we're going to probably still try to do at least like a quick v live livestream. Because uh, we have fun doing them. That's, yeah. That's why we do them. Yeah. Uh, usually Krim's the one who says, hey, let's do a live stream Because like she likes doing them, I think, almost more than I do. <gasps> Can it be? It cannot be. Oh. We're going to have to have a fight about it. Okay. All right, evil wizard Mordak, get out of the way. See what this one is. Uh, well, it's pretty clear saw. what this one is. A little saw. Look, he's a little saw. Oh, we got the lumberjack oh, handyman. Okay. He comes with a, a printed piece of of Lego wood. Oh. It's got like whatever these are called. Oh, that's cute. What are these called? The lines on a piece of wood. Um, grain. The grain. The grain of the wood. He's got painted Lego grain. Yay. Uh, his head rolled away. Here it is. That's the secret to drawing good wood. It's drawing the grain. You gotta draw the grain if you're gonna draw some good wood. Good wood. And you can have him look like he's carrying this over his, uh, his shoulder according to the picture in there. Awesome. He and the wizard can get in a fight. Staff versus saw. Yep, this guy's just like Hacksaw Jim Duggan. <laughs> He'll whack you with a 2 by 4 Yep, Hacksaw Jim Duggan is, a, is an American professional wrestler. Oh. I don't know anything about that. He has a crooked face and he goes, ho, and he waves a two by four around. <laughs> ho to you two. I don't really know why anyone likes him. <laughs> Does Seth? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if Seth actually likes him or if he ironically likes him. Ah. All right, so. Woo, also, three. no dupes so far because the only other figure <laughs> I have from this set is the fencer. All right. So let's see who this one is. And also, I should mention, when we grabbed these six... It was at one Kmart in uh, in upstate New York, mm -hmm. which shouldn't have existed. It looked like it shouldn't exist. <laughs> we just grabbed three blind and then found three at like a shopper's drug mart in Toronto and bought those blind. So I did no feeling of these bags. Oh, we got the Lady Samurai. Oh, cool. I hope we get the squid. The squid looks cool. Oh, the Cthulhu thing? Yeah. Yeah. Cute Thulu. The Cute Thulu. Cute Thulu. 
Cthulhu. Oh, she got little swords. That's yeah. pretty cool. And look, they, they did a printing on her torso, so when you don't have the armor on, she still has like... Clothes. Yeah, like a belt and stuff. That's cool. Sash. And just put this big crazy thing on. <laughs> Yo, samurai! <laughs> and she is heavily armed. Yeah. Um, she's got two giant swords. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Make sure I put her hair on the right way around. Have her bun pointing forwards. She will cut you. These are cool swords. I, I'm guessing these are the Ninjago swords. Yeah. Uh, One of my coworkers has young son, and he was pronouncing the word Ninjago, but like not correctly. <laughs> Ninjago? It was like Ninjago. <laughs> Ninjago! And I was like, huh, Ninjago? <laughs> I just think Ninjago sounds the most European. Mm. And, you know, ninjas, right? Yeah. So we go for the European content. That's halfway through this little uh, blind bag opening. Right. And we're doing pretty darn well. Yeah. So let's see what happens next. Cute Fulu. Or, or, ooh, I want the Egyptian one. All right. Shall we find out? Yes. Oh, oh first no. duplicate. Well, now <laughs> we have two workmen to fight Mordak. <laughs> one of them is before the fight and one is after. I didn't notice this, but look at the, pr the printing on his pants. He's oh, got yeah. like a utility belt on there. He's got little pockets. Yeah, that's pretty neat. Little places to put things. I'll put his, this one together all over again. <laughs> um, what do you want to do while we're still here on the West Coast? I want to try some of your favorite restaurants growing up. Mm -hmm. And going back to that one comic place, that was really cool. Cherry Bomb. Yeah. yeah Cherry Bomb Toys. They have a huge Optimus they made out of boxes. It looks really cool. i got to take a picture of it. Yeah. And they have a little baby shockwave I want to look at again. Cherry Bomb Toys is that uh, I did a video with them about a Mastermind Creations thing a while back. And uh, I shot some video of one of their toy shows. They do the local toy shows here in Victoria. Cool. They're fun folks. There's a toy show coming up. Yeah, on October 4th. Which is after we head back to the east side. Yes. But who knows, I might be back out for that. Can I do this one? You want to do the pull? Yeah. Okay, go for it. Da -da 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 -da. What is... Oh, it's the Egyptian. Egyptian. Yay. Good pull. That's... This happened entirely because of your pull. Thank you. It probably it was already the Egyptian. It probably was. It was Schrodinger's Egyptian. Schrodinger's Egyptian. Look, he and the ninja lady can trade swords. Oh, man. They can just fight. Yeah. He's got an upside down. Oh, this Egyptian sword is cool. Look at that. Yeah, it's got a curve to it. Yeah. You know swords. What's that called? A Egyptian scimitar. <laughs> scimitar? Isn't that an instrument? Nope. No? It's an Egyptian sword as well. Okay. All right, well, we've got one left. Uh, I guess we're going to see what happens here. Yeah. Um, anything else we should say during this little vlog thing? So I'm going to put this up probably tonight. Um, if we do a uh, Ignore these pants. Just, I'm not going to look up those pants. <laughs> if right. we do a V-Build Live, we'll let you know on social media. Yeah. Probably, like, hours beforehand. Just keep checking Twitters. Ooh. Oh, we got the king. Oh. So when I saw these pants, I thought we got hot dog guy. <laughs> but no, we got the king. Oh, so he's cool. got like stripy pants, Renfair pants, oh. and a pretty legit cape. Mm. I thought it was like an old timey Superman because of the colors. Oh wow, this cape is two parts. I thought it was just printed with white stuff on one side. Ooh, fancy. And like, oh wow, I think this thing's like made to have a slightly different, like wider, over the shoulder look. Mm. There's also a unicorn guy. That's kind of funny. Yep. What is that? People Caveman in alien? That's a cyclops. Oh. People in animal suits. <laughs> Lego. What is that? A Robocop? Yeah, it's just a space policeman with twin guns. Gotcha. Because that's how you do. Oh, this space. guy comes with a little snake. Yeah, a snake charmer. Aw. Cute. All right, I want to make sure this cape has the right fold to it. Mm. Capes are very important to Vangelis. They are. Very extremely important. I care a lot about capes. But the shoulders will be covered up so they don't have to be perfect. See Except for how they have to be perfect. <laughs> Perfection. Got this two capes just layered up on here. This is really well done, this king. I like him. It's a cape system. Yeah. Kingdom of capes. I, mean, I think his beard goes on before his head. <laughs> yep, so now he's just a beard. What a neck beard. What a headless beard. <laughs> Look, his head has a little teeny, like, junior beard on it for before he grew it big. 
That's so cute. You can have like prepubescent king. <laughs> I like the hair and the crown are one. Angry teenager king. Yeah. You can give the wizard the crown hair. No. Well, not now, but later. The king gets it. <laughs> the king also has a golden sword. I am Arthur, king of the Legos. Make you figures. Very good. He looks like a Superman king. Man, we had some good pulls. Woo! And if one of these workmen was the Cthulhu, it would have basically been perfect. Yeah. So uh, thanks for checking that out with us. Yeah. Uh, I want to throw out a quick apology that right after putting up a vlog saying I was going to get a video up for every day in August, I didn't. Uh, that's because of uh, some stuff that if you followed me on social media, you probably already know about. So, uh, yeah. I'll make it up to you. September will have some content. There's already a review up, and I've got two more, like, ready to go. I'm just not going to go one a day, because I want to I want to space it out until I have more built up. So, uh, thanks for joining me, Kryn. Thanks for having me. We're going to, I don't know, film some Galaxy Force packaging before I get rid of it. Woo!